What up YouTube and welcome to another battle of the League of Extraordinary Trainers Season 7 Rising Stars Conference and this week we are playing against Charlotte Chandelus. On the right side you see my team Doctrio, Urshifu, Rodemo, Gudra, uh, Licky Licky and Bronzo. Uh, good luck, have fun my friend. And on the left side you see his team with Weaval, Chandelure, Excadrill, Vikervold, Amoongus and Aromatis. Ooh, this is a hard, hard one. Uh, not sure what I want to start with. Um, Gudra can be safe unless uh, he brings Weaval. But I don't see him start with that. Excadrill could be a good uh, way to start for him. Um, I think my best bet would be, uh, let's check the summary for a bit, we have Bronze on with Gyro Ball, Earthquake, Stealth, Rock, Body Press, Licky Licky with Wish, Knock Off, Power Whip, Protect, uh, Soul Fest, Gudra with Dragon Pulse, Sludge Bomb, Fire, Flamethrower and Surf, Poltergeist, so Rotom over Poltergeist, Leafstorm, Will-O-Wisp and Defog, Urshifu with Arc, Aqua Jet, Surfing Strikes, Aerial Ace, and Close Combat, and last but not least, Duck Trio with Earthquake, Night Slash, Stone Edge, and Aerial Ace. Like I said, I think uh, Bronze Zone would be our best bet, uh, because Vikervolt and Amoongus can do really that much to us, uh, Excadrill as well. Um, even with a Cobble Barrier, we should live a hit from the Weavile and Gyro Ball it to death. So let's see what will happen in this battle. This is the second time we battle against um, Charlotte Chandelus. Last season we won. Uh, hopefully he won't get his, his revenge and we still get our win for this year. He starts with the Chandelier. The Chandelier there. <laughs> he starts with the Vikervolt. And we start with the Bronze Iron, which is pretty great. I think uh, we should start off with Stealth Rock. It would hurt the team quite a bit. Uh, stick Web, not that much of a problem since uh, half of my team is already pretty slow, except for the Duck Trio and uh, the Ushifu. But uh, those ones don't really care uh, about speed. <sighs> what can I do? What can I do? Um, I think it's too soon to go into the duck field. Could work, could be a thing. I think I might just do it. And if the Weavile comes in and attacks us, the speed will be lower, so stick webs don't really matter that much. So let's see. You are a song fest, so it shouldn't be that much. Uh, like I said, the flamethrower is pretty free. Except if he has a uh, flash fire of Chandelure. Uh, don't see him come in. I think we can live a hit from Chandelure so we can serve it afterwards. So I think Flamethrower is the best bet here. Let's see what he will do. He will go for the Volt Switch. Switch out freely. I think Chandelure can do it. Aromatis. Not bad, not bad. Now the problem is, I don't know if we are faster or not. No burn or leftovers. Let's see, let's see. I have to check real quick how fast uh, Aromatis is. Yeah, I have to do it on my phone. Because my computer can't do two things at once. So let's check. Uh, Aromatis, base 60 speed. Even 
at full speed 172. Uh, let's check. Uh, Gudra summary. Speed is on 100. Probably just to outspeed a defensive aromatis. I could, I could go for it. With a slush bomb. He protects. Now, he probably will switch out. Victor, uh, Shifu. Uh, forget about the stats. Um, he didn't bring. Oh, he did. Mm, I think going into. Ooh, this is this is difficult. Um, I think we go into the licky licky. Predicting him is gonna switch into the extra drill. And we might see here we are faster than him. Even after the sticky webs, so that's a good thing. He goes for the wish. I bronze on. Uh, I think we're gonna get rid of the leftovers here and just knock off. If the extra drill comes in, we can um, can get rid of his item, which is great. He goes straight up for the moon blast, which we took really well. We get rid of the leftovers. Because I forgot about the Monsi Broad. Rival. Oh. Oh. Rival. Uh, oh. Excar Drill. Bike Bolt. And Amoebus. So we have that. Little little charge uh, Obsidian Obster. Um I think we will go for a wish. If he goes into the action build, he in the fighter ball, it's nice. This is nice, because now we can switch into uh, Gudra again. Take a wha whatever hit. So, we go into, uh, like I said, into the Gudra. Probably take a bug bus. Or a volt switch, whatever, doesn't doesn't matter really that much. Goes for a bug bus. Did. Pretty much. I mean you're almost back to full, so that's nice. Um with the aromatis in mind. Uh, he won't go into that. Because he knows we have the slush bomb. He could go for Excadrill, predicting the slush bomb. So I think we can go for a Dragon Balls. He probably will a full switch here. If he goes into the aromatis, good play for him. But I don't think he will do that. Because the risk is too high. Then we come with a sludge bomb. And he goes for the chandelier and we make a great prediction here. And he got the shiny one. Nice. Let's see how much damage we do here. We 
We did quite a lot. And now I think we can go for a surf freely. Um, although, I'm not sure. I think surf is a safe bet here. Going for the aromatis, nice. Great middle play, uh, great middle ground play here. Going for the surf. He can do two things now. He can go for a wish, surviving a sludge bomb. Or he can go straight up for the moonblast. Uh, in that case. I think the best thing to do is go into the ground one. Because Good Rare is the best matchup here. If Aromatis, uh, we can get rid of him. Uh, Good Rare is pretty free to play today. He goes for the Wish. Not bad. Um, I think we can go for a Gyro Ball. You're not that much slower, but because of the protect. Seeing our gyro ball, he might go into um, Excadrill. Excadrill Chandelure. And I think both of them want to take an Earthquake. So let's see what he wills, wants to do. He might switch. He does. Does he go for the Excadrill or for the Chandelure? He goes for the Viking Ball. Wow, great prediction there. But this means we can switch into Gura for free again. So this is a great play on his part. Wait. Oh, he's heavy duty boots. Wow. Didn't even realize that. Uh, you can go for the Volt Switch. Predicting again. Um, yeah, I, I think Gura is our best bet here. So let's see. Let's see. Full switch. We are faster than our Aromatis. He might go for a Wish or for a Protect. Whatever he goes for, we are pretty. He goes for the Weavile. Get another nice shiny one. Uh, I think bronze on. You could go for a knockoff. Uh, who doesn't want to get a knockoff? Go for a sword dance or whatever setup. Let's go with the bronze one. I think he goes for an ice move, so we take that very well. Oh, he goes for a dark move, then we have the Golden Berry. Uh, losing it this fast. Triple Axel is a great, great choice on my part. He might stay in. We saw two of our moves. Um, gyro Ball. It's our best bet, I think. But he doesn't know we have a Cobble Berry. Hmm. Let's see. We go for the Body Press. He switches into Aromatis. No, of course not. And the Viker Roll. Didn't do that much. <sighs> We go for the Duck Trio. I think he wants the Volt Switch again. Uh, in this case, he can. So we are neutral, so the Scarf doesn't work. He goes for the Bug Boss. Damn! Damn it! Duck Trio. With the 
work bus. God damn it. But we get free switching. Bomb. Oh, now he goes for the vault switch. Okay, 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 okay. Should have done that last turn, but. <laughs> yeah. Damn, losing Duck Trio just shooting through the battle is something I didn't want. I really didn't. That was a really good play on his part. Now he goes for the Robust Beast and we go for the Solish Bomb. Will we KO it? Yes or no? Let's see. Let's see. That did nothing! Could go for another one. Can we take a Moonblast? I think we should take the risk. And we KO the Aromatis. Very nice. Uh, Gouda KOs Aromatis with Sludge Bomb. And he goes in with Rival. Um, he probably goes for Triple X or Knock Off again. Uh, I still think. Bronze on is our best bet. Now he goes for the knockoff. Take the Cobra Berry. I still did a lot. God damn it. <sighs> Go for the earthquake. Shouldn't kill, shouldn't kill, and it kills, god damn it. I play so bad. Revival. Chaos. Bronze on with knockoff. So. With knockoff. Hmm. Let's see what he is. Let's get rid of an item. Sorry for that guys. Okay, we can get rid of an item of the chandelier. We might kill the chandelier as well. Because it's pretty low on health. Licky. Licky. Kill. Oh. Chandelier with a knockoff. We get some leftovers back and we are back in the game again. Um, because I think if he stayed in and knock off my whole team, it would hurt me a lot. He still has to have moves, and that's pretty bad. Pretty, pretty, pretty bad. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Mold Breaker. Um, he might be defensive. Let's see what he wants to do. Go for the Protect. Scouting. Let's see, he goes for the Earthquake. We have to roll the most. We'll take whatever hit. Oh, he's Mold Breaker. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, 
Ooh, that's a good thing I think about that. Could go for the power whip. Although. Let's see. That is some nice damage. Go for 217. I think we might survive another hit. Do we? I think he kills us. He goes for the sword dance. So he's not choice. Oh, this is bad. This is really, 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 really bad. Shookerberry. Wow. Although, he could just stay in. Earthquake is free for him. Is it? We don't have Bronzong anymore. We have. Um, I don't want. I don't want to lose Rotom at the moment. And um, I think Power Whip is the safest. I, th I think we, we will lose Licky Licky here. I think we will. Chaos. Licky. Licky with uh, Earthquake. So, with Earthquake. Um, going to do Rapido. Rapido, the Ushifu. <coughs> he is fast enough, so um, the only real thing we can do is Arco Jab here. I don't think he's gonna switch into. Uh, well, either, either way, it does, doesn't really matter. We can get some, some chip on uh, Amoongus. Um, so let's see. He went through. Of course, LA Ace would be a better thing, but okay. I should have done it. Let's get some nice chip. And he is Rocky Helmet. Okay. He doesn't have a dark type move. Oh yes, yes. Ah, wait. He has. Go for the toxic. Flamethrower is pretty free. His whole team doesn't want it. Because we get rid of the Roma T's and the Chandelier, which both uh, take the fire moves. Let's just do it. Biker Vault with the heavy duty boots. Let's see. Oh, he did some nice damage. Nice, nice damage. I think Flamethrower is spamming here at this moment until uh, Kudra dies. Did you get. The KO, Gudra, Chaos, Vikervolt with Flame to roll it. And Here comes the extra will. He wouldn't. He wouldn't go for the sword dance here, he, he dies. He straight up dies. He must attack. Let's see what he wants to do. He goes for the rapid spin, taking... Ooh. 
Eska, Drill, Chaos, Gudra with a Rapid Spin. Let's see. I have Aqua Jet. You're running out of time. How is it possible? This is a two hit KO. Take some rocky hammer guys. We might switch out again. Let's see. I have to be quick here. Ah, you need rock. But it doesn't really matter. How much damage does it take? Almost kills. <laughs> I think I think we are faster. Are we, are we faster than him? No, we are not. <gasps> we survived! Oh my God! Urshifu, beast! Urshifu, chaos, Excadrill with Aries. But I think this is the, this is the point where we just lose because because he can go for triple axle and he wins. We can't win with uh, with Aqua Jet because he has the Amoongus. He goes for the knockoff. Get him rid of the Rocky Helmet. Go for the leaf storm. Viva Chaos. Low bomb grid. Uh, triple axle. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I could go for close combat. Ooh. No, 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 no. He can't. Then we lose. He wins. He just wins. And Rival. Chaos. Shifu. With Ice. Shard. So, GG to uh, Shadow. Uh, yeah, it was a great match. I made some mistakes here and there, uh, especially in the, in the halfway. Um, yeah, it's, he, he, he prepped better than me, I would say. And uh, losing Duck Trio this early it could have saved me the match because uh, neither Escadrille or Rival were, uh, how do we call it, were choiced choice calf so um, I think definitely he would he would uh, Dr. Leo would bring me the game he would win me but this is Pokemon you can make mistakes you can lose you can win uh, whatever GG's to my opponent um, I hope you guys enjoyed this battle I did I did and hopefully see you guys next battle bye